the impact of dividend policy on shareholders' wealth before and after financial meltdown, evidence from FMCG sector in India. This article is written by two authors. First author Sandinam J. J. Lakshmi. Last author Ramakandra Nazigaya. Contribution and originality of the study is that the study used new estimation methodology such as augmented Dickey Fuller test, white, heteroskedasticity test, autocorrelation, Prayuk Godfrey serial correlation LM test, Durbin Watson and ARCH LM test, and Chow test for analysis. Very few studies which have investigated the impact of DP on SW before and after financial meltdown studied the structural changes. However, the present study proved that the DP is significantly and positively related to retain earnings per share and earnings per share SW. The result of the study is consistent with the findings of Gall et al. 2012, Salman, 2013, Bawa and Core. 2013, Ezegaia and Sabiripriya, 2008, etc. Dividend Policy DP, of corporate sector is widely researched topic in finance however, it remains a debatable issue to decide what factors determine the DP. The objective of this paper is to analyze the impact of dividend policy DP, on shareholders' wealth SW, of fast-moving consumer goods. FMCG, sector in India. Out of 16 firms listed on National Stock Exchange, NSE, 13 firms that have been paying dividend consecutively for the past 10 years are considered for analysis. In the light of the prior literature, key predictor variables such as earnings per share, EPS, dividends per share, DPS, retain earnings per share, RPS, price earnings ratio. PER, lagged price earning, lag per earnings, EAR, and lagged market value, lagps, are considered for analyzing the impact of DP on SW. The descriptive statistics reveals that the data form into normal. Whereas when the assumptions needed to be fulfilled for the ordinary least square method, OLS, the data are found to be homoschedastic and are free of autocorrelation. Augmented Dickey Fuller Test, ADF, White, Heteroschedasticity Test, Autocorrelation, Prayuk Godfrey Serial Correlation LM Test, Durbin Watson, Lag Range Multiplier, LM, for Autoregressive Conditional Heteroschedasticity, ARCH LM, Correlation. Ordinary least square regression and Chow test are applied using EVUS 7 econometrics software package for analysis. Regression result proves that DPS 121.65 and RPS 9.68 have significant positive coefficient on EPS SW of FMCG firms in India before global financial meltdown, while DPS 76.74, LAGPER, 1.52, and LAGMS, 0.27, have significant positive coefficient, 76.74, on EPS, SW, of FMCG firms in India after global financial meltdown. The results of the Chow test proves that the FMCG firms have significant shift in structure, positive improvement in respect of SW after global financial meltdown. Thanks for watching Thighs Abstract Video of Financial Risk and Management Reviews Volume 1 Issue Number 1.